Hi there, once again, it's Jerry with Amazing Grace Radio, and I just wanted to say happy Saturday. May God bless you, provide, protect, heal, deliver, and save you, as well as comfort you and give you peace and wisdom in your heart and mind and spirit, soul, etc. <laughs> I normally just don't chat spontaneously, but I'm trying to go live. Well, actually, I'm not live, but I'm alive, but I'm not going live, but I'm just trying to put myself out there because guess what? Michael Basham does, so he encourages me to put my voice out there, so I'm trying to do so. So when I first started podcasting in 2015, it was just one format. I would call somebody via Zoom or well, actually, no, it wasn't Zoom. I would call a guest via Skype and I would record the call and it was just mp3 it was just audio and I would upload it to YouTube or Spreaker and that was it it was just very very basic nobody could see us really but then we graduated to using Skype to record the video of me talking to said guest Uh, and now it seems to be standard fare that we use Zoom to talk to somebody via video, upload the MP3 audio to Spreaker, Apple Podcasts, Spotify. Anyway, I'm just talking about this from a creator standpoint. And it's amazing how knowledge has just completely proliferated with an uptick and upspike. Now I'm using made up words with a, a huge spike upward very quickly in the last few dozen years, in the last 10, 20, 30 years. I mean, if we think about the people back 100 plus years ago or 200 plus years ago and and tell them, you know, hey, look, we'll be able to talk to people uh, via Zoom. You know, uh, we can see their face. uh, We can talk to them in real time. Uh, They would think that they were, that we were crazy. They would think that, that we were nuts and and uh, that it's, it's the realm of conspiracy or conjecture or, um, or that we need to wear a tinfoil hat or whatever. <laughs> um, although I don't think they had those, those types of memes uh, or those types of concepts back then. Um, we know that a certain three-letter agency has pushed forth a false narrative that those who are awake and alive, red-pilled, etc., cetera, uh, are tinfoil hatted or need a tinfoil hat or something like that. But... Anyway, so it's amazing how 150 plus years ago that our ancestors uh, in times past, grandfather, great-grandfather would never dream of or fathom us being able to listen to podcasts or uh, talk to people in real time and what have you. I think it's just just very interesting that, that that's happened. But nobody would have thought that several years ago, or I'm sorry, several hundred years ago, um, 150 plus years ago. Um, Anyway, so I remember that one scripture that states that knowledge will abound in the last days. So I believe that we are living in the last days according to scripture. So we are living in the last days. And so the question would be, what has proliferated the uptick in technology uh, from basically not having any type of phone or or, or telegram or any type of, of technology to uh, do doing what we're doing today. So I believe that uh, the fallen angels through Tesla has proliferated uh, this uh, type of technology. So on one hand, the fallen angels probably have given these uh, ingenious uh, people to to put out uh, whatever technology is out there, uh, and so so the question is, you know, are these technologies in its in and of itself evil uh, in terms of TV or internet or Wi-Fi or anything? No, I don't think so. Uh, in fact, I know so, but uh, just like anything neutral, it can be used for good or for evil. So we hope to use this for good, for the kingdom of God and to, to bless others. Uh, just like a person can go to the internet to search for uh, a global Christian community uh, where people are identifying each other in the Lord or, or just like we can uh, listen to, you know, 
this, for example, uh, some godly stuff, hopefully godly stuff on Spreaker, uh, or you could you know, search something destructive like internet porn or what have you. Anyway, just some thoughts and some musings. Anyway, hope you have a blessed day. Talk to you later. <laughs>